Hello, I'm Philip Lopate, and I'm going to talk to you about a session that I'm conducting, uh, five things I learned about reading and writing the essay. Uh, now, the essay is a form that I, that I love and that I'm identified with, although I've also written a lot of fiction and poetry. Uh, in fact, I started writing fiction and poetry, uh, and then it came to me that I could combine the two skills in some way, the, the, the storytelling skill of fiction and the associative skill of poetry, because essays can accommodate both. Uh, so uh, I'm, it's my bet that in order to write good essays, you have to have read some of the history of the essay. You have to really immerse yourself uh, in reading essays to get the sense of what they can do, how much variety they have, uh, in other words, you don't have to reinvent the wheel. It's already been invented. Um, so the first thing is to uh, learn to love reading essays. And so I'm going to talk in this session about um, some of the uh, masters of the essay and how they approached it. Uh, and that's one of the five things. Uh, and uh, then we're gonna go into how you can uh, improve your own writing of the essay, uh, if you're brave enough to try it, and I think you should. Uh, and so that will take us into uh, areas like um, how do you construct an arc of an essay, which is essentially the storytelling or the, the plot element, um, the importance of digression, uh, how do you, how do you um, uh, impart um, tensions in the essay, um, how do you end an essay? Uh, so all of these are all of these things are um, craft issues, uh, which we'll be getting into. Uh, but first, we'll come um, the understanding of what an essay is, um, how much variety it can contain, and then um, how you yourselves um, can fool around with the essay and have a good time. And I hope we will have a good time together. 